Hello guys, welcome to the channel Learn Think Right. In this video, we will be seeing tuples in Python. Okay, so tuple is also a collection of elements of different data types. So we write tuple as t equals to. Okay, here I have given example. Still, I am giving it. Suppose a b c one d e f and so on and list we write in the square brackets and tuples we write in the parentheses okay understood so this is the way to write the tuple now what is tuple and what are its benefits or features so tuple is ordered collection of elements that means if suppose you have one tuple the elements are stored in continuous memory locations and given index from 0 1 2 3 4 and so on okay so we we can access the elements continuously and they are stored in continuous memory locations next even though we have list why do we use tuple then tuple is used in conditions where we need faster access okay when we want to perform faster operations tuple is used because it is very faster than list and in some situations you have to apply the conditions like the data is never changed okay the tuple once created the contents are not changed in some situations you don't want the contents to be changed by mistake okay that time we use tuple so when, once the tuple is created we cannot change the contents of tuple now the next one is duplicate elements are allowed in tuple suppose here i have taken tuple 12 apple 9.6 I can take here again 12 so the tuple elements can be have duplicates duplicate values now next if suppose you want to access the element at specific index or specific location you have to simply mention the index number and here you have to use the square bracket okay and in that you have to mention the index so index second means you are accessing the third element in the tuple now if suppose you want to access the elements from here if you men mention 0 that is ok otherwise also it is ok simply you can write colon 1 so this will give you two elements ok so starting with 0 and ending with 1 so it will display with this 12 and a b c ok this is the way to access the elements of tuple now next we are taking here one more tuple naming t2 and assigning it value x y z and this is the way to combine two tuples we are taking one more tuple p3 and assigning value t1 plus t2 so now what t1 will be having what t3 will be having t3 equals to what are the contents of t3 now 12 abc 9.6 12 then xy z so this was all about tuples hope you understood the tuples and uh, the code for tuples hope to see in upcoming videos till then subscribe the channel like share and comment thank you